We will get our master coil in from the mill, and then we have what we call a breakdown slitter. We would take the 48 inch, break it down into a couple smaller side cuts. For example, 24, 18, and five and a half. And then those side cuts, the 24 would probably go back to stock, the 18 would probably go to the 18 inch slitter, and the five and a half may go to a smaller slitter depending on the thickness range. Typically the first question is, do you have this type of metal? And if so, how about this temper, this thickness? The next question would be the width. What's your width tolerance? Standard for slitting is plus or minus five. We can go better than that. We can go tighter at plus or minus three. And sometimes on our like age slitters, we can even do better than that. But we guarantee plus or minus three as our best on slitter widths. Through the years, we've learned some lessons along the way. We've improved our crating materials and our packaging specs internally. We'll include uh, desiccant materials, which prevents or circumvents moisture from getting into the crate to prevent rust and damaging the material. Everyone at Mead cares about the safety of our customers' orders. We want our quality product to get to our customer's dock in the same condition that it leaves our dock. And that applies to anyone from our receptionist all the way to our shipping clerk, which is responsible for getting the shipment out in good condition. And we always take pictures of the shipment before it leaves so we can transmit those pictures and show you exactly how carefully we did package the shipment. We at Mead Metals try very hard to keep your budget in mind and we try to treat our customers as family and make sure that when we ship your product out the door it gets to you in the same condition as it left here.